Hi, my fellow food day friends. Welcome back to my channel. Today I have a very exciting food day beauty brush order um, that I just wanted to share. So it's the Koyudo Saipai Koho Kabuki large powder brush. I got mine in the scattered Sakura design. This brush is 45 millimeters in length. The handle is cherry birch wood and it's the Cherry Blossom Maquillet Design. So, absolutely beautiful. I just love the way Saipai Coho Goat looks. Mine is a little dent from the packaging, so don't mind it. I have not washed this yet. But look at the shine to the bristles. They're like translucent. Um, the hair is a very straight, very fine, super luxurious. This brush is very dense. The density is unbelievable. Just stunning. I opened this brush, truly gasped with how beautiful it truly is. Um, I also wanted to read off of Fude Beauty's website. They did a really beautiful job um, explaining this brush. So excuse my pronunciation for some of the names <laughs> and what I'm about to read. I'm going to do my best here, but they say, Fude Beauty says that this powder brush is part of Cuyuto's limited edition collection. The collection is a luxurious masterpiece by skilled Cuyuto artisans. The brush features densely packed bristles of the softest, highest level goat hair, Sai Pai Goho. Saipi Koho is prized for its silky texture and luminescence and its ability to create a natural luster on the skin. The handle is made from cherry birch wood, finished with traditional maquillage lacquer techniques, imbuing them with a sense of sophistication. The cherry blossom maquillage pattern is hand painted by the artist, and again, excuse my pronunciation, um, Shoishiro Oshida to give it a luxurious feel. The Sakura Cherry Blossom motif is a natural is a national flower of Japan and highly auspicious symbol meaning wealthiness in the beginning of new things. According to an ancient definition, Sa in Cherry Blossom means the god of the rice field and the spirit of the grain. And Kura means a place where the god is. Therefore, Sakura has been regarded as a symbol of harvest, abundance, and good fortune. They couldn't have said that any better. <laughs> that is exactly what this brush is. It is pure luxury. Um, is it necessary in every Fude Lover's collection? Of course not. But if you're looking for a luxurious beautiful handmade Japanese brush. This is truly it. And the reason I wanted to get this video up when I did is Fude Beauty actually still has, as I'm checking now, four left in stock. They are in the Sakura Branch style maquillage design. I got the last Sakura scattered sakura cherry blossom in stock i do notice that they come in and out of stock quite frequently i don't know how long that'll last for considering the very rare hair type but again they do have that other maquillage design in stock as i'm filming this video four brushes left what's great about buying it on food Day beauty is um they're the brushes on their website right now are actually on sale. So it is cheaper than going to CD Japan. So that's that's definitely a bonus considering, you know, how expensive this brush is when you can get any amount of money off. That is definitely preferable for sure. But just an absolutely stunning brush. I can't wait to wash it to see how it blooms. I'll definitely showcase it in a future video once I've washed it, just so you can see the true potential of these beautiful, luxurious bristles. Um, but yeah, just an absolute masterpiece. Kuyudo outdid themselves with this brush. It comes with this beautiful Paulonia box. 
just beautiful. You get the beautiful presentation as soon as the brush arrives. And I actually like to store my precious <laughs> Fruit Day brushes in their boxes that they come in just to keep them dust free and beautiful. But I just can't get over how soft these bristles really are. You know, I was very curious if there was a big difference between Saikoho and Saipikoho in the Japanese market. And it sure is a, a major difference. I mean, if you're somebody with sensitive skin, it feels, if I was to put it on my face right now, very, very similar to squirrel bristles. And that's no lie. Granted, this is um, pre-wash, but just incredible. And I can only imagine how um, amazing Sai Paikoho was years and years and years ago. If it feels this nice right now, I can only imagine, you know, a few years back, because I know the hair quality has declined, but in this brush, it truly hasn't. I mean, of course, I don't have old Sai Paikoho to compare it to, but in my humble opinion, with my Takeda EXS bristles I own, um, even some of my Chinese Fude or some of my Chinese brushes, Saipi Koho, it's just not, there's really no comparing. It's just absolutely incredible. And I can't speak highly enough about this brush. Um, and as a reminder too, if you, if it's your first time buying on Fude Beauty, I do have discount codes, um, that I will put in my description box where you can get money off so the brush is on sale you can get even more money off by using my code and I do want to take the time and thank everyone who's used my affiliate links so far um, it truly means the world to me I'm honored and I do receive a very small commission any of that small commission does go back into buying other brushes that I can showcase on my channel and that way I can give you guys my honest thoughts comparisons so I really do appreciate it but what a true work of art this brush really is. And it really did deserve its own video just by how stunning and it's just a true masterpiece. I, I just can't stop petting it and staring at it. It's absolutely incredible. Just a beautiful brush. And I just feel so lucky that I was able to add this to my collection. I initially wasn't going to. Um, and the more I kept seeing them come in and out of stock on Fude Beauty, I was finally tempted. I said, you know what? I'm going to do it. And I have absolutely no regrets. If you're looking for something that you will cherish for many, many years, just something so precious when it comes to Fude, this brush is just gorgeous. I can't stop staring at it. <laughs> I'm just obsessed if you can't tell. Absolutely obsessed. So I just want to thank you guys again so much for your support so far on my channel. It means so much. Um, if you have any questions, comments, leave them um, down below. Um, subscribe if you haven't already. Sign up to um, sign up for my notifications every time I upload. I try to upload as much as I can. Um, I do have other video ideas coming up here soon once I get some time. So, um, but this one I really wanted to get up as soon as possible, just because again there are still some available on Fude Beauty for that discounted price. And yeah, it's just so worth it. I mean, just look at those bristles. They're absolutely beautiful. They just have that luminescence to them. And this isn't even in natural lighting. This is just from my impressions vanity <laughs> lighting. And if it looks this good in studio lighting, unbelievable. In natural light, it's just like they glisten and sheen. Absolutely gorgeous. But anyway, enough blabbering. <laughs> Again, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye, guys.